Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Audrey. If you're returning, welcome back. Today's video is a decor part three. If you have not seen part one and part two, I will link it in the cards. I wanted to start off my night of decorating with some fresh baked cookies so I could enjoy them once I was done. Since this is gonna be quick and easy, I figured might as well have fresh baked smell of some cookies and these are some of my favorite kinds they're the minis so they're a perfect little snack and they're so easy because they're already pre-portioned into these small cookies so i preheated the oven and i got them ready and i stuck them in and i went ahead and let's get started okay i want to start by showing you guys my old stuff first so i have some cute little kitchen things here this is like for a spoon and then I have one that says North Pole Milk and Cookie Co. And then I usually pair it with like this gingerbread, super cute. I think I got that last year. And then Miss Claus, totally me and the cookie company. I actually wanna make a shirt that says something with this. So maybe I'll get around to doing that for Vlogmas. I got this cute little jar. You can put kind of whatever in there. I still have, oh my gosh. Anybody else obsessed with evergreen smell? Or like any Christmas tree? Oh, it smells so good. Okay, I still have this candle from, I think it was last year uh, from Bath and Body Works. So I didn't want to like splurge and get more. I need to use up the ones I have first. And then I actually made this sign with one of my sweet friends. I want to say like two years ago or so, but CA Farms for Corey and Audrey Farms or now Kelly Rosen and Ovalee and Christmas tree established back in 2009, 11 years ago, pine, spruce, fir, free delivery, hot cocoa. And what's fun is I can actually like make those signs now that I have a Cricut. I had this like table runner at the old house. I don't know if I'm gonna use it this year. I'll be honest, haven't decided. I'm kind of going with a different theme eventually here. I just wanna wait and not get too much. I already bought a few more things. <laughs> These are all like last minute decor items for upstairs. This was my last priority since the Christmas tree is downstairs. I wanted my wreath up and the downstairs. So this is the last one. This is a pretty bouquet that I had and I actually just like keep it in a bundle. <laughs> it's kind of cheating, but then I just like, I'm, I'm able to switch it out every year. So I made that like a year or two ago. And then last year I purchased these. I wish I could tell you, I think I got them at Walmart, if not Target, but super cute with burlap at the bottom. Okay, now for the new stuff. So I started off with getting pine cones that are cinnamon scented. And they smell like literally you're chewing big red gum. That's such a good smell. I love cinnamon. I also am gonna do my own table runner. This is decorative mesh and it's really cute because it has like what I think looks like snow. <laughs> I don't know. But eventually I want like the upstairs, maybe next year or the year after, to be more of like a winter wonderland and then Downstairs will be like the green and red with like mixed metals in some way and that'll be more of like the traditional Christmas. So I kind of want to have like two different feels. I also bought more <laughs> of these trees. They look the same guys, I promise. They're a little bit different. These ones I did find at Target this year in the dollar section for $3. So they're just a bit different, but that's what I love because they can go together or apart whatever I want to do, I guess, with those. So I bought three of those and I have the three big ones. Then I found these. I honestly, <laughs> I honestly wanted to buy so many more. I stuck with two of them. They were kind of expensive in my opinion, you know, cause I know all of this will be like 50% off after Christmas, but I wanted it before, okay? I wanted a white tree. I told you guys that, but I compromised for a mini tree. <laughs> So I got two white Christmas trees or like froth, whatever, frosted, I don't know, whatever they're called. 
$10 for each one. So I spent 20 bucks on these two little guys. So let's go ahead and decorate the upstairs. It's super simple. This is all I really have. I don't want clutter. I'm up here every single day and this is like the dumping ground. Like I am already cleaning this every single day. So I just want it simple. Eventually I'll have my tall tree in here or something. We'll see in the next year to two. I wanted to keep above the window super simple. This is where I do dishes and I like to clean. So I wanted a little bit more of a clean look here, less clutter. I like to be able to see some sunshine come in and look out the window as I'm cleaning. So I did not want to cover it too much, but I thought the little bit of greenery and this Christmas tree sign was the perfect little touch for the windowsill. Okay, I think this is my favorite part of the decorations that I did this night. I put it on the table runner and then I threw in five trees, three of the green and two of the white ones. And I love this look. The cinnamon pine cones smell absolutely amazing and make the whole sm house smell like cinnamon. It's delicious smelling. And I just love this natural, simple decor look. Let me know, comment down below, what do you guys think of my table decor this year? There is going to be eventually a video showing you hopefully what I did for this table. It's not completely finished. We still have a few chairs and another side table to do, so I will be sharing that with you in a future video. corner I wanted to have a little bit of a pop of red to brighten up the corner so I found that this was the perfect spot this year for my flowers and I threw a little hat on our statue that looks just like our puppy Royce and I thought that was super cute and then of course my Miss Claus sign had to join the corner over here for some fresh baked cookies most nights I have such a bad sweet tooth Absolutely love how everything turned out let me know comment down below what was your favorite part and I hope that if you haven't already go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and comment below and if you haven't subscribed I would love for you to join my YouTube family I'll see you guys in my next one bye guys uh oh let me check on the cookies I think they're burning they are burning. Talking too much.